Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to episode number one of the Shotcut Masterclass here on my channel. This is breaking down everything there is to know about an amazing video editing software known as Shotcut. Hands down a great beginner video editing software. If you've been involved in video editing for a while, you probably uh, you know, escalate it to something a little bit more advanced. However, it is an amazing intro video editor, an amazing uh, you know, way to get yourself uh, way to dip your foot in the water, if you will, you know what I mean, and kind of get comfortable. The, this is, uh, you know, the full masterclass breaking down everything there really is to know about this program. If you watch these simple six to seven videos, you're going to know it all. And, uh, you know, you'll pretty much know how to use this program entirely. You'll be very comfortable on it. That is my goal, at least, that I'm starting out the series with. So if you're not watching this video in the playlist already, check it out in the description. Without further ado, let's go, uh, you know, jump into the video. So on screen is shot cut. This is what it's going to look like when you actually load up and you're going to be doing most of your maneuverability in three different areas up here, which is going to be your uh, controls. So for example, you've got your, uh, your playlist, which is going to be where you're going to import all your media to and your filters, which are going to be effects and stuff like that. Um, and uh, overall your properties right here as well, which will be uh, information on clips and stuff like that. So that's actually where we're going to be dragging our clips in. Now, where we're actually going to be watching what's currently going on, whether it's in our timeline or previewing what our clips that we've imported are, um, is going to be right here in this window. And, um, you know, um, if we've dra dragged clips into here and we want to watch them before we put them in our timeline, we can watch them on the source window. And if we've already dragged them into our timeline, we can watch them on the project window once we've actually, you know, established the project by dragging a clip into the timeline. And then, you know, you can you can adjust the size of all these by these little dots right here. And this is where we're going to be doing all our composition right down here in the timeline. And, uh, you know, this is pretty much where we construct everything. These are going to be our tools. We're going to have a full a full lesson, which is I think I think it's going to be the next lesson after this, breaking down all the tools and shortcuts to familiarize yourself with. And, uh, you know, just having those shortcuts in your back pocket so you can be editing really quickly on this program. And, uh, you know, everything is pretty damn simple. It looks like um, I mean, it's really, really, really simple compared to other editors out there. Hands down, uh, you know, the layout is very, very simplistic. They've catered this towards beginners. And, uh, you know, if you are a beginner, you're in very good hands because Shotcut is a great way to learn, uh, you know, editing and overall familiarize yourself with video editors. Pretty much all linear video editors like this are going to be pretty similar. They're going to have a preview window, a media, uh, you know, blockade or a media section. Um, and then, of course, a timeline where you're going to be doing all your composition, your chops, your cuts, and your edits. And, uh, you know, all your actual video editing, if you will, is going to go down here. But that right there is the video editing basics of Shotcut. Why don't we go ahead and import a couple clips real quick just to finalize off this first episode, which really I just wanted to make sure you're comfortable with the layout. The next episode, we're going to go over the tools and shortcuts. And uh, let me just go ahead and open up my computer. I want to open up a folder and actually just import a few clips, which are some pretty funny clips actually of me climbing and breaking into an abandoned castle. Yeah, you heard me right. So to actually import, you want to just go ahead and find the folder that you have your clips in and just drag them. And you see when you drag them, it kind of comes up with the option to copy them over here and you could just let go. And that's actually going to teleport right to here. And just like I said, it has a source window up here, which you see you're on your source. And if you click on the clip, it's going to come up in the source window. So our first clip is me and my homie walking up the side of the castle. Okay. And then my other friend Noah is driving a drone after us. So you can actually see us walking up. And uh, you know, this first clip is just us walking up the steps of this castle. The next clip is going to be us trying to jump up the wall to climb into the castle, which shout out my homie Yarn. He's a little bit heavier set than I am. He, uh, he wasn't having the easiest time climbing up this wall. And I'm pretty sure I came right after him and I showed it out. Yeah, I'm about to show him how it's done. Watch this. Come on now. You know, I'm not much of a climber, but if I got to climb, I'm going to do it right. <laughs> no, nah, I'm, I'm pretty terrible at uh, physical stuff. But that one right there, I definitely showed Yarn up and he tries again. He, he doesn't make it. And then we cut to the next drone clip of me actually walking into the castle. So we got some dope footage. Don't worry. Like throughout this series where I'm going to try and include as, as much cool stuff, whether it just be, the, you know, the clips even as I can. So that right there is our clip. How would we create a timeline? We create our first timeline by either dragging one of those clips here. You see how we have the option to drag and drop it right down here. Or we could actually just go ahead and right click and go add video track. But usually I'm actually going to go ahead and just drag something in because it's going to optimize it. I just drag it down here. And then we can drag this back over here. And we have officially dragged in our first clip. And, uh, you know, just like that, that's that's kind of how we do. Okay, that's kind of how we do. We've dragged everything in. And, uh, you know, we've sort of started off. So right there is going to be, um, right there is going to be where, where we want to start our clip, right? So right, right about there. Okay, so just to finalize this, 
But let me just go ahead and go all the way to the end until our cursor changes to this guy. And let's just go ahead and see if we can just adjust this by dragging it over. Again, drag that over there. And, uh, you know, we've just trimmed our clip so it starts where I want it, where we're just walking instead of us waving at the uh, camera or waving at the drone like we were before. But that right there is the video editing basics. If you enjoyed, make sure you check out the next episode of the Shotcut Masterclass. The uh, thumbnail will pop up on screen as soon as I'm done this video right here, and it'll start playing. So by all means, just, just keep watching, basically. I'll shut up now, and I'll see you guys in episode number two.